everyone i'm sharing with you how to make another basket it's super easy um, the interfacing i use i use the midway interfacing because my fabrics are a little bit heavy fabric so um this can be made for the it's the basket or you can make it for the cookie or bread you could just change the interfacing and i will list the different interfacing in my description for you to look at and the y side of the interfacing i cut it 12 and a half inches and 19 inches long usually i when i iron the fabric in the um, interfacing into the fabric i use to cut an extra fabric all around but this time you don't when you iron on the interfacing it's hard for you just try a little bit on the right or wrong side first and then turn into the fabric side, the right side of the fabric and iron on this side. It works out much better too. But this fabric it has some gold kind of gold from the outer of the leaf and the flower. It looks so beautiful. I got this last time at Joanne Fabric when it clearance. Alright, so now I'm gonna go in the from back side and I'm going to cut exactly the same. You're going to fold the long side in half like this. Alrighty. So now we're going to sew it. I use a quarter of an inch seam allowance to sew this. I show you where to sew. So now you're going to sew a quarter of an inch on two sides all the way up leave the center starting from here all the way all the way to here from here all the way all the way down so everyone after i sold it in here and i here i sold it up here so it's good enough for me to reach over and if you want to leave it longer you can so your hand can reach in and cut a little bit right there so i can press on the side like this go and do this on the sole line like this spread out on both sides this side and this side very cute and it's quick to make too when when you do it yourself it's quicker because i do have to talk so that's why it takes longer for me to do but if you just cut and do exactly what it is, and it's quick. Now, when you look in here, this is what we're going to do. Is if you don't um, pay attention, and you're going to mess up the side in here that we're working together, and then this side right here, we're going to work together. Okay, so I'm going to box the bottom of the right side and the top corner here. So I reach my hand in this hole. You can leave it bigger, okay? Um, everybody hands different. So I'm gonna do this to box the the bottom of this. You're going to make sure this sole line touching the fold line, and that's how you know it's even. So I'm going to do three inches. Clip it right where you mark for now and then at the same side this is the, the bottom okay this is the bottom of the right and the same side on the top you go into box exact the same make sure you press this too and then from here you see my hand is in there and I'm going to touch this too Do exact the same measurement. Three. Let me just do this first and then I'll show you. 
very very easy okay so now i have the two bottom sliders okay i'm going to hold it together and touching this together like this okay take the clip out clip it right there take this two clip and clip it on it right there go sew this together Now we are done for one side everyone. Just take this clip out as you can see. Okay, so we've done sewing these two together. Now go into this left side. Remember the left side we're going to do exact the same. So reach your hand over on the bottom here. Spread this out. The sew line, it have to touch the fold line right here. So you do this, you can have that evenly. Like this. You can feel it right here and then the line right here. Three inch. On the bottom is done. Now the top right here. I'm going to do exact the same. Open this. So we took the boys to the uh, to check their eyes. Me too. And then we well, the whole family go. Every time we make appointment, the whole family we have party. So we got there, and then everything is good, and we pay. Do exactly the same. Okay, three inch. Um. So we just sit in down and make sure everything look good, and then get the pay how much we need to co-pay and everything and then brandon look on the table and then he see the thing that you can use your payment credit and everything so he say why is that number it it's showing like like bumby kind of number and then the the woman who work there say that for the blind people so they can feel it number for their credit card user and then he say why we at the glass store <laughs> so now fold this together clip two together and then from here take this clip out and then clip this two together just like the other side this one too same Go ahead and sew this two together. After you sew this two together, go and cut this out. Leave about a quarter of an inch like that. Cut the extra away. You're gonna go right inside first and then from here you're gonna slide on the side of the left and then go on the side of the right and start sewing this in. So after I sewed the bottom here, it look nice and hide all that So line. I'm going to iron, make sure you iron it and it come out so beautiful. It's so easy. You can make bigger if you want. Go ahead and top it all around.
when you want to turn this around make sure your needle always hold on to the fabric so the stitch always stay straight Everyone, after we top stitch the top one right here, you're gonna go to the corners here and then you go on to clip and then sew. So, very easy. You're going to go from each corner right here and then you use your finger and pull like that up. Clip it down. You're going to sew just tiny bit right on that fold just to keep this shape. But when you do that, you're gonna make sure it's where right here, okay. Nice and square like this. And then on the other side, do exactly the same. Right here, that is your corners, and then go up. Clip it down. If you want to make it bigger, double the size or whatever. Okay, everyone, I'm just showing you the technique how you use this thing like this okay so clip it around very close to this you go on to sew together and then sew this side and this side I'm finished everyone look at this basket it's so cute you can put so many things in here too you can put your dread in here whatever you feel like doing I'm just showing you the technique how you use it look at the size it's beautiful that so nice eight in and a quarter and the depth is three inch three inches so adorable in three inches. So just like that everyone, you can put your dress in there and it's good to go like that. It's so so cute and easy to do. So you can enlarge the size too if you like everyone this is uh, good enough for your sewing room and knead it up a little bit look at that so pretty stay safe and take care everyone thank you so much for watching please continue to support my channel by like share and subscribe and if possible watch the video in full to support my video retention everyone